Hey guys, Junction Tech here, and in today's video, we will be reviewing um, this trap cleaning set. I've taken it all out of the box, so it'll be a lot easier, and the video will be three times quicker, hopefully. So yeah, this is these is the these. This is the packaging for the trap cleaner or the one that I have. This this is the only twenty two pound one, but it's a really good job. I've just cleaned my track. Um, it's amazing from what it used to be, as you might have seen in the other videos. Yeah, let's just get right into this. So this is by Hornby. Um, it's OO gauge. It doesn't really focus very well on my camera. Um, obviously it's no one, no one under three. Doesn't want to focus. Please focus. No, I don't want to focus. Um, Hornby logo on the back and just a load of like, you know, warnings and stuff like in different languages. Anyways, that's pretty much it for the box. Not too much. It's not the best pattern you've ever seen, but it'll do. Um, we'll come up with uh, with the track cleaner. Or you don't you don't need liquids or anything. All you just need is these little um, paddies, and you get six of them. Like you can rip the little stri stripes off. They've already got like a little lines in front of them for where they're supposed to be ripped. Which you can't really see on video. But yeah, then you put them on the little side at the bottom of the uh, the uh, little unit, which I'll show you in a minute. And here you've got instructions, which literally just tell you how to use it, which is kind of handy. Um, the cleaning coach. Uh, that's the number which doesn't want to focus either. But yeah, there's a load of all the writing. So if you guys want to read this, I guess you could like, pause it or something. Doesn't really focus very well, sorry about that. But yeah, it's just like, you know, how you can use it, like, how, what you have to do and stuff. And this is about like where you can put the these rubber or the little pad things which feel like sandpaper. Um, I've already used two, it won't come like that, it'll come like a little thing, but I've already used them. And you just rip the little strips off and you put them on there. And yeah, and you have to keep making them go the same way around, you know, the other way because it'll reverse the dirt back on the track. So you don't want that. Um, here is just some more writing about how to use it and stuff like that. And about this is you can like, you can take the lid off and stuff and you can check the insides to make sure it all works properly just in case it doesn't work properly. Um, yeah, that's pretty much the instructions. We just push it this out one way. Let's actually come into the unit now. So here you go. Here's the unit. It's literally just a small little, um, it's literally just a small little carriage, but it's got the little white, um, window panes, uh, the black roof, just yellow with the little, uh, the black lines going across, and that doesn't want to focus on the writing, but it does say, track maintenance department as yeah the um the these rubber thingy the sandpaper like thingy is largely made out of sandpaper it feels like sandpaper it's quite rough to get all the oils off the track that's where you put those on there and it should just fit on there because it should wrap on the bottom and it'll pretty much i haven't put them on there now but i'm just going to do this quickly so you guys have to put on the track. So that's on the track with these little black things here where the rubber or the I don't know why I'm calling it rubber, it's not really rubber, but where the um you put the strips and they'll spread across the track and it'll clean all the stuff. Go around each loop about three or four times or so. Um yeah, it's actually just normal wagon just with those on the end and the the roof comes off really easily like, by pulling it. Now, I would show you guys this in running, but I've already cleaned the track again today, and I don't want to keep using these up, because I'm going to use them once every month or so. So, um, yeah, so if you guys do like these kind of reviews, please do um, leave a comment of what reviews I should do next, or what other videos I should do next. So, yeah, please like and subscribe, and don't forget, guys, just peace out.